What's up, Power Maniacs? Power Stasis here. We are back in the world of Fallout New Vegas. And what we're doing today is something a little different. Um, last episode, we were upstairs. Uh, we couldn't get the thing to fire. The reason we couldn't get things to fire is because I hadn't sorted out the ground uh, mainframe dingama duber bob dealies or what? Excuse me, whatever you want to call it. We've got one here, and I believe the other one is over there. So I've got to set these up first. I'm hoping I have enough skill to do so. Go ahead and quick save, see if we can't sneak in here. Now, as you can tell, this place is armed. Oh my god, to the teeth. Ah, oh, damn it! I want those fucking things. That's a lot of EXP if I can disable them. Alright, let's do this one first. Disarm the bear trap. Disarm. And... Oh, dude. Oh, you can see right there, there's a pistol aimed this way. I'm pretty sure it's set to go with this. Unfortunately, I, I don't think I can get around to disable that from here. Um, the other problem that we're going to run into is we've got two bombs. We've got one right there and one right here. So I'm going to try this again. I want it pick up! I'm looking right at the damn thing! That is some fucking bolt. You know what? Screw it. Are you serious? I think that one's technically under the floor, which is why I can't hit it. What about this one? That one worked. So that was the problem. This one right here is underground, which is why I couldn't tag it, and that's the problem. Alright, so we're going to go ahead and activate the rigged shotgun. Hopefully we don't hit anybody over there. Uh, disarm. We now have a rigged shotgun. I don't know what... I guess that was part of the... I'm trying to see where the rope went to here, but I, I don't see it anywhere. Obviously, this little thing right here was what was used to do it, but I don't see... It didn't go up the, the ceiling here, so... Oh, well. Alright, it's Terminal 1. I'm going to go ahead and resave real quick, see if we can't access Terminal 1. Oh, I already have the password. Well, shit. Reset mainframe connection. Alright. This one is set and we are good to go. That was actually pretty easy, surprisingly. Alright. Let's run over here. Kind of sucks that that mine was under the ground. I kind of wanted to have the option to access that little monster. Unfortunately, uh... With it being underground, I can't really grab it, which kind of blows. It means it's just going to explode in my... F Why are you screaming? What are you freaking out about? Oh, shit. There's going to be something in here, isn't there? Oh, man. Let's reload. I got a bad feeling about this. Um, this is going to end bad. What's my percentage on this one? His front leg, really? You have zero hitch? It says 95! You're a damn liar. Hi, doggy. Oh, he's so cute. Hey, Miss Man. I can't kill you with one hand. That is an awesome achievement. Alright, that's fine. I'll reload. you buddy all right guard dog problem solved bitches and thankfully nobody outside seems to be any of the wiser that I just took out all of the damn guard dogs oh no no my science skill isn't high enough oh shit all right stats 
Skills, where's my science at? Science oh god, there is no fucking way we're gonna get there. Absolutely no fucking way. Well, that's bullshit. Alright, so, unfortunately, um, I can't do this quest until uh, we get a little bit higher science. Uh, I can raise artificially my skill a little bit with some of the stuff, um, but I'm, I'm not really going to be able to raise it that high up. Uh, unfortunately, it's it's just too much. So, uh, I don't... Alright, one of the guys is saying a dude inside has the password. So, we're going to go inside and see if we can find the password for that. It's probably one of the other lab techs in here. I'm hoping. Because otherwise, we're going to have to come back once we get a little bit more skill. And by a little bit more skill, I mean like five more levels dumped straight into science, which would make me really angry. Because I want to blow some stuff. Guys in the stream are all screaming at me. It's the guy inside, damn it! I'm like, alright, alright, calm down, calm down. We're going for it, man. Should totally be able to just rip it off there. Okay, so Mr. Fantastic's probably not gonna give it to me. What about it's this guy? It's unusual to see a new face here. Are you a soldier or a scientist? Uh then we have that in common. Whom do you typically work with? <laughs> Very well, yes. I'm part of the fall oh! of the If you're not familiar, we seek peace and the spread of knowledge. Knowledge that must never be lost to the world. Now your turn. Oh, fuck. That's reassuring. Although many who've made that claim to the followers of the apocalypse over the years, I've had less than pure intentions. Oh, I'm completely but pure. But if it's really as you say, then take my advice. This installation carries with it dangers that no one here has realized. Take care of what you do here and who you listen to. Some things are best left buried with the old world. I don't entirely know. Uh -oh. Our records on the company that built this place suggest that their dealings were not only in energy, but also in He weapons. doesn't know about Archimedes. And I've seen equipment here marked with symbols used by the pre-war military. Targeting computers, shock sensors. A code word comes up repeatedly in the papers I've looked through here. Archimedes. Uh-oh. Yes. And the technology they have in this facility is like nothing I've seen. Some of it reminds me of Enclave equipment, but more advanced. A weapon based upon it would be catastrophic. <laughs> who claimed it? It's no wonder the Brotherhood wouldn't give it up. They weren't here for me to ask, but I doubt they were here for electricity. That's weird the that they couldn't get it out. It was under Brotherhood control. They usually steered clear of one another, but something here changed their minds. The Brotherhood's interest in pre-war technology has always been in weapons. It's likely they were trying to reclaim Archimedes when the NCR arrived. Interesting. Then I would say do it. As long as the power of this plant is committed to the regional grid and not to a weapon, we are safe. So give me the password. If you're the one to restore output, then you can route the power where you choose and they'll never be the wiser. I can't get you past the security in the tower, but I can be of some help. The password! I've discovered a password yes! for one of the mirror control terminals outside. You'll need it. Give me that! Oh, the NCR has their own designs for it, no doubt, but resist the urge to send it only to the thriving communities. The need for power is great everywhere. Distributing it evenly is the most rational and humane choice. Well, that's true. I'm a man of letters. I'd be torn to pieces by the security system they have in that tower. I'd never reach the mainframe. Good to know. But eventually, the NCR will. Or if not them, Caesar's Legion. They will use this place for war. <laughs> because the possibility exists, you might do anything else. You're the only choice I have. You are fucked, bro -heem. You are fucked, bro. Not yet. By some miracle, they've hired an imbecile to try <laughs> the systems here. He spent months working at one console trying to get the solar reflectors to track the sun. What he doesn't know is that the only thing the console controls is the <laughs> intercom system. That's fucking wrong. I tried to tell him, but he insisted that the largest console had to be the most important. Still, it's only a matter of time. <laughs> Guy's a dumbass, man. 
<laughs> He's been working on the co the fucking intercom system for months. Brilliant! Brilliant! You gotta love it when they're when they're made stupid. That just that makes it so much easier for me. All right, let me go ahead and sheath my weapon so we get that that extra half a step of speed. Hopefully this password will work over here now. I really don't want to have to come back after 75 science because that would just completely and utterly suck. Oh, dude, I hope Archimedes is awesome. All right, what do we got here? Oh, snappy snap. Password entered. And reset mainframe connection. And shake complete. All right, so now we need to get upstairs. Unfortunately, I don't believe there's a quick travel option to get up to the top of the tower, which is sad. There totally should be. I'm half tempted to just fight all the NCR before I go up here, but something tells me it might be worth waiting until we get to test our new toy. Now the only thing that sucks is I have no problems melting all the NCR in here. I have no problems frying that idiot that's been working on the intercom for like the last, um, I don't know what, two months. I do kind of feel bad about the nice guy down there. He's like the only cool dude. Oh, what? Oh yeah, I already, I already stole that. He's like the only cool dude here. So, you know, I, oh damn it, I went the wrong way. So I, I kind of feel bad about fragging him. A little bit but then again he is part of a group called the uh, the followers of the apocalypse which you know that that's kind of like adding terrorist to your name your, your organization's name while you guys may be nice people and you know love bunnies and kittens and and all of that shit you know having terrorist in your name kind of hurts the overall factor of you know what you're trying to accomplish All right, let's make sure this is working now. All right, configure power grid. Archimedes 2. All right. Oh, 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 all right, let's uh, let's save before we do this. Now, see, the cool thing is, I can I can use this and maybe come back here in a minute and fix where the power is aimed. Possibly. Let's head on down here and see what happens. Man, they make me earn this. Walk, walk down, and, and you know the funny thing about this is. I had to go really, really deep to get into that door that somehow ended up on the top. I guess it was like an elevator. The console is unresponse. Oh, shit. 9 to 3, and apparently we are... We're at 6. Alright, so we need to wait uh, 12 hours. will put us at 6 a.m. So, 13, 14, 15. Let's do 16. That way we know we're beyond 9. And uh, we should be good. Now, like I said, um, I kind of want to leave the power to everybody because then you know everybody gets the benefit and the NCR and Caesar don't really get a, a say but at the same time I can't really leave the NCR here because they might be what is that you guys see that over there we're gonna have to go take a look I I'm curious what that is I don't think I've ever seen that before so oh what did we just do Oh shit. Um, okay. Um, alright, well, I'm gonna put three points into speech. Get speech to 50. And then we're gonna go ahead and dump science as high as we can. Alright, we're gonna continue. Uh, what are the new actions we got? We got strong back, stone wall, sneering imperialist. Oh, screw that. Quick draw. Quick draw makes all of your weapons equipping and. Uh, no! Grunt. 
Just good, honest infantry work. You do 25% more damage with 9 mils, 45 auto pistols, SMG, service rifles, assault, and mark... I really think that's a good perk to have. Commando. That one's a good one. I've already got shotgun surgery. When using shotguns, regardless of ammunition used, you ignore an additional 10 points of target's damage threshold. I like that. When using a pistol for similar one, your accuracy as bats is significantly increased. No. No. Comprehension perk, you gain double the bonus reading magazine. That's kind of a good one now, because that would allow me to get a little bit higher. I don't care about EXP. I don't care about retention. I really don't care about rapid reload. Don't care about that. Special point is good. What is heave ho? Quite an arm you got there. All thrown weapons fly further and faster. Confirm bachelor. No light touch. Heavy armor just isn't your thing. You've learned to customize light armor for maximum benefit. While wearing light armor, you gain a 5% critical hit chance to your enemies and suffer a 25% hit chance. Um, what does cannibal do again? Eat corpse, but every time you feed, it just lets me regain health. I mean, there's a cool crazy factor on this one that, that would be really kind of cool, but I I honestly don't think it's it's really worth it to me. So for me personally, I think the only options we really have are going to be either Grunt, Commando, or Gunslinger. Grunt, Commando, or Gunslinger. So for those of you guys on the stream, vote quickly. Grunt, Commando, or Gunslinger. I will let you guys make your choice real quick. A lot of guys are saying Grunt. Yeah, I think Grunt's pretty good because it does a, a complete wide variety of weapons. And that does seem to be what everyone has said. So we're going to go with Grunt. Because it, it basically does every fucking weapon in the game. So, alright. Grunt it is. And then we can back that up with Gunslinger later. So. Uh... Whoa, 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 don't burn me. Oh my god. Where are they? Uh. Oh! 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 This is awesome! Oh, dude! Dude, every Texan needs a toy like this. This is amazing. Oh. Oh, that's bad. Two, one. Oh my god! Holy shit! Have a nice day. Oh, dude. Oh, dude. We just fucked some NCR up. Alright. Um, we're gonna go ahead and save. And we're gonna fast travel to the front, Helios 1. I wanna see what happens at the front here. I have a feeling they're all gonna engage me. Oh, no, they're all dead. <laughs> they won't be engaging shit. They're all dead, bitch. I think I can help myself to this ammo box. Thank you. Curious. What happened inside? Oh. Apparently, a crash happened. Well. Brilliant, Fallout New Vegas. Thank you so very much. Let's get back inside real quick. See what... <laughs> Apparently, my awesome was so amazing that it, uh, it, it shut... It shut the game down. It's like, well, damn, bro. Can't go laying the smack down on some motherfuckers like that. That just... That just is a little too hardcore. I'm hoping... I can get back down there. Alright, let's, let's try this one more time. If it crashes again, then, uh... We're just gonna have to figure another way in. Whoa. Did you see that? Did you see that tear there? It was weird. All right, let's try this again. 
And I'm gonna go ahead. Well, no, I don't want to save here in case it bugs out again. Oh, don't crash, don't crash, don't crash. There we go. So, like, all the NCR that were here are now gone, dude. I mean, I knew it would wipe the ones outside, but I didn't expect it to wipe the ones inside. Thank you, sir. Uh, what's in the box? Oh my god. Dude, this place is fucking loaded. Hell yeah. It's my place now. This is my, like, my fucking base now. It's all nice and shit. A police baton? I'm getting some trouble with that shit. Alright, let's go talk to the, uh, the idiot. If I recall, the idiot's down this way. Let's get our gun out. We may need this. There may be a few holdouts who, who weren't burned to death at the first sign of defiance. So I, I need to make sure that uh, some of them are still here. It's going to be kind of funny to see if this, uh, this idiot's still here. He's going to freak the fuck out. I'm going to laugh my ass off if they blame him for it. Of course, I got infamy, so something tells me even if he gets blamed for it, they somehow knew it was me. Alright, what do we got down here? Is he still here? He is! Well, hello, idiot! Hey, man. What the fuck, man? <laughs> hey, loco. You just killed my paycheck. I sure did, sir. And you know what? You know what? Not did I just kill your paycheck. I just killed you. Alright. I'll go ahead and take that and that. And he had the damn password on him the whole fucking time. Asshole. Alright, is that other guy still here? Hey bro. Hello. What have you done? Get away from me. I killed people. That's what I did. I kinda like you though, so I'm gonna leave you here. No reason for me to for me to murder him too. He was nice! He gave me the password. I kind of liked where he was coming from. You know, he wasn't an evil asshole. He was a nice guy. Alright, let's come loot this bunch of bodies out here, dude. There's going to be a ridiculous amount of loot out here. Oh, dude. Dude. Dude, you're missing your leg, bro. Where'd your leg go? Poor bastard. Take that dog tag. I'm pretty sure I can sell those dog tags to uh, Caesar's Legion. Which I plan on doing here a little bit later on. You know, this knife will probably actually be worth it here in a minute. So I might as well hang on to the knife. Alright. I'm going to creep over here real quick before I repair. There we go. Service rifle. Can I get close enough to this dude? It looks like one of them survived. Because there's a there's a hostile unit out here somewhere. That kind of creeps me out. I, I nuked this place from fucking orbit. And apparently one of them stayed alive. I'm, I'm not really... I'm not really cool with that. I love how every single one of these guys has a combat knife. Well, the good news is we're going to have probably two or three fully repaired service rifles. And those things sell really well. Of course, I'm hoping that Edie can uh, carry a few of them. I think Edie may actually be over her weight limit, so that may suck a bit. I'm trying to make it through this, this playthrough without cheating, but it is getting harder and harder every time we go. Not only that, but I got bugged out with those 45, uh, 45, uh, rockets from the last quest. There we go. Alright. Okay. I don't really care about the armor. I mean, the armor might be an upgrade, but I'm not too concerned about it. Let's go ahead and upgrade these knives. Okay. Uh, see, combat repeater, or cavalry repeater, no. 
as my rifle. All right, here's the service rifles. Now, the reason I'm repairing even the better guns, um, I actually kind of want to reduce the number of these I have. There are far more efficient ways to repair these so that you don't, you know, just butcher a bunch of this stuff, but I don't really care, honestly. Uh, and I can drop this now since I no longer need it for now. America Adventure outfit. Put that back on. There we go. And we are good. We are beautiful. Beautiful. Now we do have one more dead NCR over here that never... Uh, a couple dead. Apparently they never made it out of their poor little cage. Now it's possible I might need some more NCR armor a little bit later on. If I do, I'm pretty sure I can run around and kill a few and, and not really have any problems with it. The nice thing about NCR is they are kind of everywhere. So killing them and finding some of their their meat suits to wear shouldn't be too much of a difficulty for me. Hopefully. There we go. So we have two fully upgraded um, suits, a couple fully upgraded uh, weapons. What I want to take a look at now is out there. You see that building over there? I am rather curious as to what is over there. Now, I don't think I can get out... I don't think I can get out through the gate over here. I think this whole place... Here we are, you know, we're in the damn apocalypse, but I'm pretty sure this whole place is nice and sealed. So we're going to go ahead and go to Helios 1, where I'm apparently vilified. It is my base, but I am apparently vilified here. I have taken the place over for great justice, or great suffering, depending on how you want to look at it. And they've, uh... It, this is Pyro's base. I should be loved here. I should be adored. It, it really hurts my, my feelings. But uh, we are going to run over here real quick and just take a look at the station before we call it a day. I just want to make sure there's nothing interesting over here. Uh, after this, we're going to head up north and continue on the main quest. Uh, the main quest has us going up to the crossroads, which is just north of here. Uh, we need to check in with those guys. Uh, unfortunately, I do believe there are a few NCR there. So I'm going to have to be kind of careful. They may want to shoot me. I may have to come back here and pick up another NCR meat suit so that I look like them. Uh, and then we can pretend to be... Uh, Pretend to be an NCR long enough to not get shot in the face when I walk into town. So I will have to uh, to save to make sure that they don't hate my guts. So, but uh, but uh, it should be good. Now this looks like a power station. Now that we've gotten closer, I'm gonna go ahead and resave. This place looks a lot different. Up, uh, what the hell? Is this the place I was looking at? This looks totally different. This looks totally fucking different. Oh, damn. Is that NCR? I do believe this is NCR. Oh, yeah. It's funny. I couldn't see this from there, but I could see this from there. Just give us an ex... Mess with any of the equipment here and I'll mount your head on a stick. Really? Goose. Been too long since I fired my weapon. Really? You know what? I don't like. Mess with any of the equipment here, and I'll mount your head on a stick. I don't like any of you, motherfuckers. So here's what we're gonna do. I'm gonna save right here, and then I'm gonna kill every single fucking one of you. Okay. That's one. That's oh. Oh shit! I'm sorry. Actually, no. I'm going to hide right back here. Items. Aid. We haven't had to use any stim packs in a while. Actually, we're just going to blow all the Sunset Sarsaparilla. And we're going to blow one soup. Well, we'll just normal stim packs. There we go. Alright. We're going to put one in your face, sweetheart. And one in... Your service right? No, it's not a service right, but what is it? His arm. Holy 
Holy shit, she survived that? Oh, fuck. You're down. We got one more. Buddy! Buddy! No. no! Damn it, stop running. Stop running! Now! What? Now, say you're sorry for being mean to me. Say you're so- I didn't want to kill him. But I'm pretty sure this is gonna do it. Thank you! Alright. See? Why couldn't you just said sorry? You didn't have to be an asshole about it. God. Alright, I'm gonna take his armor, his dog tag, and his service rifle. Thanks, bro. You have a. You have a. Yeah, you ain't mounting my head on a spike now, are you, dick? Alright. Um, weapons. See, that's why you gotta be careful in the wasteland. You don't shit talk people you don't know in the wasteland, it just ends badly. You never know if that person's a crazy motherfucker. You just be nice, you go about your business, and you hope to fucking God that they do the same. Because if they don't, you know, you wind up with a crazy motherfucker like me who will just shoot all of you. Ugh, and of course it's locked. I'm wondering if there's anything even worth it in there. Let me come back over here to these three dingleberries. Alright, what kind of... She's got the Vandalier army. I'm going to go ahead and take that as well. Take the service rifle. Exit. Ew. Where's the chick? Oh, well. Ah, there she is. Hey, girl, what's up? Alright, knife, dog tag. And do you have the Vandalier armor? No, you have the face wrap armor. I don't need face wrap armor. We are getting heavy. Here we go. That should help. So we now have a meat suit in case we need to look like the NCR again. Um, well, that's awkward. Um, God, we got so many fucking service rifles, dude. We're almost back underweight, though. So close. Edie, can you carry anything? Or are you overweight? Wow, you... Okay, well... We're going to do that thing in Fallout New Vegas that you do when you absolutely need to free up some space. You eat all of the shitty food that you don't need. So let's see. Um, we'll eat this, and this, and this, and this, and this, and this. Uh, new Cola Victory. I'm going to hang on to that because that looks special. Purified water. Uh, yeah, we're going to drink all of that. Stealth boy, stem pack, weapon. Oh, we're good. We're good. All right, we can move again. Brilliant. All right. Why not just drop it? Because I stole it, fair and square. Oh shit! Hi guys. How many? Of oh damn. Well, <laughs> this is gonna be interesting. All right, double tap to your head. Well, I'm going to just put two into you and hopefully I get a crit. What do I got over here that I can hit? Uh, I can hit 95 in your leg. Yeah, let's cripple that leg. Alright, here we go. Right, your head's crippled. Your leg's crippled. Oh, shit. Come on. No, not Edie. Why would I want to shoot Edie? More importantly, Edie, why aren't you shooting them? Are you having fun, Edie? Are you on break or something? I'm popping this guy. No. Oh, shit! Fuck! What 
what can I hit on you? What's your head percentage? That'll work. Her head's crippled. And he's... Oh, God! He's dead. Fuck me! Oh shit! Alright, my head's crippled. We need to fix that real quick. Stats. Our status. Fix our brain. There we go. Alright, brain fixed. Help ourselves to their dog tags and their service rifles. I'm gonna leave the knives this time. I may not even be able to carry all these rifles. I want to carry all these rifles, but I may have to leave them. I'm just running out of space. Alright, let's take the dog tag and the rifle. Good news is, I'm gonna have enough ammo to start my own army here soon. Which I'm kinda looking forward to. Alright, so we do have one computer over here. God, I have a thousand bullets for this thing. That is ridiculous. Power the substation. Leave the access point alone. Okay, so apparently I can't even make any modifications here. That is that is kind of a bummer. I feel let down. Alright, do we have anything in apparel? No weapons. Um, combat knives are already maxed out. Oh, I have another knife. Well, can't hurt. Perfect. I have four flawless service rifles. How much do they go for? 2160. Holy shit, dude. Oh my god, those are amazing. All right, Edie. What is going on with you? Used ranged, yes. Wait, used ranged. Wait. Okay, used ranged. Be aggressive, beat your stem pack. Wait here, talk to, back up, keep distance. I think she'll fight. I, I don't know what's wrong with her. I've never had her on aggressive and she always helped, or he always helped. He just recently stopped helping, which I'm, I'm not a big fan of. I don't know what the hell's going on. Yeah, I'm gonna have to go sell because we're, we're running into some, some massive storage issues. It's just bleak, man. It's just bleak. All right, so these poor bastards, thankfully, were keeping my place warm for me. I now have two bases. Oh, dude! Oh my god, I can shoot their heads off! Oh god! This game is sick! Can I shoot their legs off? Oh my god, I can! Dude, this is disgusting! This game is so cool. Absolutely cool. All right, guys, for, the, for those of you who haven't run away screaming already and are watching this on YouTube, hopefully you guys are liking this series. If you do, please slap that like button. Make sure you subscribe, and I'll catch you guys in the next clip.